Hey guys over at uh, Jackson Plumbing, this is Fernando, I'm making you a video to show you um, how you guys can uh, do some tweaks to your website to rank higher on Google and bring some more business to the door and outcompete your competitors. Anyway, today I'm going to be talking about three things. I'm going to be talking about content, backlinks, and citations. Initially, uh, the content that you put on your website is all of this text. All the words, numbers, letters, anything Google's uh, search engines can read and look for key terms. So like St. Augustine or plumbing services, the more uh, text you put in there, the more times they let you put those key phrases in there so that when somebody searches for plumber in St. Augustine or St. Augustine, Florida plumber, you guys pop up in the rankings close enough uh, to the top so that they can see you on the first page and again this is all very doable don't think it's not so in terms of keywords or uh, content you have some content the website is really nice but you need more content on here so you can put more key phrases on here and if I were to copy and paste this content it looks like you have 149 words of content on your website your uh, competitor that ranks at the top of the uh, Google search locally one of your competitors has uh, this content on their website and this is probably not as much as they should have but it's more than what you have on your site so I would recommend increasing your amount of content uh, to beat theirs and because they don't have that much it's very doable so let me show you a typical search on Google this is plumber St. Augustine Florida just one of many one of the more popular searches at the top here is the ad section these are paid ads and the way people pay is they bid and the higher bids get the ads up here so if you're going to do that and you know it's something that you can do and it is effective it just some browsers block these out and sometimes people don't click them just on principle so you know you can spend money here and it will work but it's not as efficient as getting organic uh, traffic and organic uh, rankings so these things if you're going to do them make sure you put whatever key phrase you want to be found by at least a couple of times in the uh, text of the ad and then make sure the ad reads uh, smoothly so that Google can figure out what kind of uh, business you're in and they can uh, connect you with these ads with these uh, searches. Um, the ne next thing I want to talk about is backlinks. Uh, this is a special tool we use and you can actually go to the uh, Google search and search backlink checker and keyword checker and they're free and you can check any website yours and your competitors for backlinks at any time so this is one we use it's a paid um, it's a paid tool but uh, it's not necessary so it shows uh, your website and you guys have 59 backlinks coming from 20 websites uh, and that leaves you with uh, 35 organic keywords that people uh, search you for and nine uh, people find your website organically from Google searches uh, per month this is just an estimated value of your traffic if you had to buy advertising, they figure you would have to pay $5 uh, to get that traffic, which isn't much when you think about it, but in reality, you would probably have to spend more. I think it's an underestimation. So let's um, look at the uh, competitor again and his analysis on RFs. And you can see their numbers are higher, and mostly because they have a huge number of backlinks. Now, it looks huge, but in reality, it only comes from 367 websites. And this is something that's achievable over time, and it's something that's worth going after, because honestly, all these backlinks that they have are backlinks that you can get for yourself. And that's the way you rank. You go to their backlink section, and you copy exactly what they did, and then you get more than them, and you will rank higher than them that's how Google does it so you go to different different websites that they've put their link on and have allowed them to put their link on and you do the same thing and if you do that and do the same number or higher you will rank higher than them that's simple as that so anyway their um, keyword matches on their website they get 23,000 and that leads to 17,000 people and this is a per month number and just to give you a feel for what the value is compared to if you had to advertise for that or pay-per-click you would have to pay fifty one thousand dollars that's essentially what they're saving by ranking their website organically instead of paying for ads alright so the um, 
last term I wanted to talk to you about is citations. And citations are basically uh, listings in web directories like Yelp, Yellow Pages, and Yext, where you put your name, address, and phone number uh, of your business, of course. As long as it's correctly spelled, Google will find it. And the more of those citations you have out there, the better for you and the more authority Google will give you and the more likely that they'll rank you in this section. And citations are considered also a form of, of uh, backlink, but it's a different form that you don't require a link on a citation page. Just your name, address, and phone number can be typed into any blog post. And that's how you get in here, and this is obviously a valuable place to be. Um, although my preference is to try and rank up in the organic section because a lot of people skip right over this and go to this section here. All right, well, that's all I have for you. So to recap, you need to increase your content on your page and add keywords, and you need to increase the number of backlinks to your page. And lastly, the number of citations out there on the Internet with your name, address, and phone number need to go up. And you do this slowly over time, so start as soon as possible because it does take time to get this all done and for Google to assimilate it and start utilizing it. All right, guys, thanks for your time. I appreciate it. I hope I was able to give you something that you guys can put into effect and drive some business. And uh, have a great day.